Hey everybody, I'm gonna do my first Little Ninjago review. This is the Radicopter. It's ages 8 to 14, number 9443, and 327 pieces. Get three minifigures Lloyd, Garbanon, Kai, ZX. Instead, he has a jetpack instead of shoulder pads, and he has some daggers. And you have Fang Shui or Fang Sui. What do you want to call them? And then you have two white snakes over there in the box. And then the Constrict Eye Staff. Mm, and the ripped up box. Um, it did get ripped up. But I managed to keep it for this review. And then the Poison missile shooters, the spinner pieces, two of them, snake bomb drop, and then you get the first staff of all the staffs. Then you hear Kai, Kai, saving Lloyd, and Feng Shui over there. Set the box to the side. Get on to the main figures. Get down. Start off with Lloyd, Garmadon. Looks really nice. You can see his face there. His um, torso printing, short legs, and the black cape. No back printing on his body. You can see. Try and remove that. No back printing. This plain Lloyd. And see his hood. More of a better view on him. When he has a more scared face. When a rattlecopter comes at him. Also have his weapon. More of a vector type weapon that was used for Lord Garmadon. Um, in the first season. I think it was a torch or something. For staff. Looking thing. And then we have Kai ZX. Looks really cool. He doesn't come with the shoulder pads. I did wish he come with the shoulder pads. But, uh, whatever. You can see here. You can see his nice torso printing on the ninja star. A lot of detail on him. He went on his legs there. And a huge jungus jetpack, kind of. And see the jetpack better. And he also had the Shinobi helmet piece. You can see his face there, more scarred up. And then you can see his back printing. Let's see. Put that on him. Mm -hmm. And then he also comes with his daggers over here. Just put them on him like so. Just battling Feng Shui on the radicopter. Like that. And then he has his jetpack so he can fly around. And he also has Feng Shui, the pilot. That looks really cool. He has a really nice head mold. Like the mold thing sticking out. Looks really nice. Yep, there too. Have a necklace and some scale printing. Some red stripes. Really detailed figure and a hint of back printing. Some more scale kind of printing. Let's make sure. And then we have the constructor staff. I'm not sure why they put it in, but it kind of makes sense because it's not in any other set right now. So that's really nice to have this. You actually get another. You get two of these fat round symbol of a constructor thing. 
So you can just put in anything you like. And then you also have two white snakes. New 2012 molds. You can have a handle here. You can hold the snakes like so. And then more of an S mold there. You can see that. You can see his faint, tiny fangs. Nice. Pretty cool piece to have. Get the figures to the side. Go on to the red copter. Looks really awesome. For my first ninja set. It looks really cool. I love the snake head. And if you look front to front, it looks really creepy. Start off with the fangs. Kind of move what position you can make it fly. If some cockpit area. They were there. You can fit only fangs way. Yeah, that's a little bit. More of a chill place cockpit. One of the better cockpits. See more of a kind of unprinted piece there. Oh, that sticker. Um, not unprinted piece sticker. Kind of aiming for something there. As you can see, it close up like that. Let's cough it. Also, it has this slanted downward kind of part here. Like the this part, the copter part. I like that's more slanted downward, makes it look cool. And you have this adjustable flick fire missiles. Yep. Let's shoot them far. Let's see if we can do it. It's really far. Grab them. There. Two more. You have your engines. You have the kind of wings. You can kind of adjust. Mm. Over here, you have the snake bomb drop. I'll show you that right now. Two snakes in this hole here. As you can see, you can like, slide it in there. Put another one over here. And just drop it when you're in the air, you're flying. Drop it on the ninjas or Kai there. See if we can make it kind of like. Chase them around and stuff. And then you have some detailing like scales, some scale details, and this can just move around. And this piece kind of moves. And the spinner pieces, and just hold it like this and can fly nicely. So, overall, Really awesome set. Really love the build. When I was building it, I had no idea what I was building. Then I come to the end, and it was looks really awesome. For my first snake vehicle. Kinda cool. Really awesome set. I would say um, not a bad price per piece. Really great price per piece. Love all the features. Pretty decent set. Um, so I'm gonna, definitely going to give this a 10. There's nothing really wrong with it. Love all the features and all the stuff. So I'm give, definitely giving it a 10. So yeah. This has been my quick review for the Radicopter. Hope you enjoyed this video. And catch you guys later. Bye.